Welcome back to the Hollywood News Channel, where we update you with the latest news of the day. Hello, everyone, and welcome back. According to former White House aide to the President, Omarosa Manigwalt Newman, the First Lady weaponized her style choices to make swipes at Trump. Ms. Newman made the claims in her book, Unhinged, an insider account of the Trump White House. The author wrote, taken as a whole, all of her style rebellions have served the same purpose. I believe Melania uses style to punish her husband. Ms. Newman highlighted the time Melania wore her Gucci pussy bow pink blouse to one of the presidential debates. This came after a video emerged of Trump supposedly bragging about sexually harassing women. The author also cited Melania's I really don't care do you jacket, which caused severe backlash. The first lady donned the jacket during her trip to a Texas border facility last year. It came after the Trump administration faced blowback for its zero tolerance immigration policy. Ms. Newman wrote the first lady was forced to visit a facility to mop up her husband's mess. She claimed the message on the jacket was directed at her husband. The author added, she wore that jacket to hurt Trump, setting off a controversy that he would have to fix, prolonging the conversation about the administration's insensitivity, ruining the trip itself, and trying to make sure that no one asked her to do something like that again. The president responded to coverage of the jacket by claiming his wife was attacking the fake news media. He tweeted, I really don't care, do you, written on the back of Melania's jacket, refers to the fake news media. Melania has learned how dishonest they are and she truly no longer cares. The White House denounced Ms. Newman's claims she was fired in December 2017 by former White House Chief of Staff John Kelly. Melania responded to Ms. Newman's claims and said she was disappointed she was lashing out at the president. The First Lady made the comments through her spokesperson Stephanie Grisham. Ms. Grisham told Newsweek, Ms. Trump rarely if ever interacted with Omarosa. It's disappointing to her that she's lashing out and retaliating in such a self-serving way, especially after all the opportunities given to her by the president. The former aide also claimed Melania was eager for her husband to leave office so she can divorce him. Ms. Newman wrote, in my opinion, Melania is counting every minute until he's out of office and she can divorce him. A suggested rift between the president and the first lady was outlined in another book, Fire and Fury, inside the Trump White House. Author Michael Wolff claimed that Trumps do not share a bedroom. It comes as speculation rose over the couple's relationship after they were accused of not spending any time together. A close friend of the Trumps told the Washington Post they spend very little to no time together. Thank you so much for joining us and see you in the next video. Bye. Thank you for watching the Hollywood News. Don't forget to like and share the updates to the latest information of the day.